welcome to TWF NXT on mic today with Jim Ross and with Booker T and today on NXT we're gonna have a good show here today on NXT uh Mike today says and uh, we really believe that we're gonna if we can we can prolong the bond the war the wrong you know between Seth Rollins and Medusa who has been warring ever since the ninth month of this year well I can tell you one thing right now you're right about that Mike one thing is that Seth Rollins and Medusa started their wrong because Medusa didn't like Seth Rollins because she came from you know that she came because she came from Big Rock you know <clears throat> And you know, I don't really have a bind of anyone, you know, for anyone who comes from Big Rock. Apparently Medusa did. And had a bind with him, because he came from Big Rock. Jim Ross said, I don't know why that was, why he didn't like him. She didn't like him, you know, since he came from Big Rock, Jim Ross said. I can tell you one thing right now. Uh, Booker T. So I tell you right now, Mike and Jim, the grounds to why he didn't like him, why Medusa didn't like Seth Rollins coming from Big Rock, I don't really know why. I just know she shit didn't like her, him coming from Big Rock, you know. And if we can prolong this fight here today, you know that would be good. But I don't know if that's going to happen or not. Well, we got Molina Perez in the ring today. Uh, Mike today says, the former three-time WWE Women's Heavyweight Fighter, former two-time WWE's lead, you know, lead woman fighter, which would have been the Women's World Heavyweight winning <coughs> two times. WWE two-time women's heavyweight fighter in WWE 2. Alright, Melina Perez says, I'm the WWE Ender, the WWE, the TWF Allegheny Share Fighter. And I know that this, I know that a lot of folks out there are like wondering, who am I going to put, who am I going to put my winnings against? Like, who's going to come out here and fight me for that? Because I'm having, like, you know, an open dare. You know, for anyone who wants to fight me for it. So, hopefully I'll get someone who wants to fight me for it. You know, I can tell you one thing Mike today said. I can tell you one thing right now Mike today said. Melina Perez didn't think that she was going to get anyone, you know, who wanted to fight her. You know, for the, you know, fighter, you know, for the TWF, uh, Allegheny Chair winning. But we'll see if someone, if, we'll see if someone takes her up on that deal or not. Um, Mike today says, yeah, we will, Jim Ross says. We just gotta hope someone is gonna take her up on it. You know? And I believe we did seek someone who is going to take her up on, on that deal, on her open dare. You know? It's, it's Poe. Well, Poe, I didn't think you were going to be the one, you know, who was going to, you know, take me up on my deer. For my open dare for the TWF uh, Allegheny Share winnings. Oh yeah, Mike. Oh yeah, Booker T says. Tell me right now, Mike and Jim, why is Poe in the ring for? Why did Poe take? Why did Poe take Molina Perez up on her open dare? Well, because it was an open dare, Mike today says. And if Poe wanted to take, ah, oh, shit, wanted to take Molina Perez up on. On her open dare, he could do that if he wanted to. 
Mike today said, yeah, Jim Ross said, what do you got against Poe anyway, Booker T? I get it, you're a heel, you're a heel cast caller, but truly, what do you got against Poe taking up open deer with Melina Perez here today? What do I got against Poe, Mike, and what do you actually got against Poe? Is that he's from, he's a dream work self, you know? He used to team up with Gold Dust once, calling itself Pogue Dust. I mean, come on, what kind of tag team name was that? Like you didn't team up with a lot of folks, Mike today says that a lot of like, like no one scathed you or said that you couldn't be sick, that you couldn't go for any single winnings after you spent many years teaming up with Stevie Ray and then with Tess and Gold Dust and Rob Van Dam and don't forget Scott Steiner and Tian. Don't forget Scott Steiner. Yeah. Mike today said, and Jim Ross says, this coming from the man who spent most of his time teaming up with Stevie Ray and WCW, then teaming up with Tess and Goldust and Rob Van Dam and WF and WWE, then teamed up with Scott Steiner and TNA. So do not scave Poe for fighting Melina Perez. Yeah, well, I just don't think he's going to make a good TWF Allegheny Sheriff fighter, you know, it's not like he's going to do anything to help Allegheny Sheriff out, you know, at all, well, we'll have to see, we're going to see who's going to, if this match will happen or not, Mike today says, all right, Melina Perez, you said you had, you had, that you want to have an open dare, and you want <coughs> open dare for the TWF Allegheny Share winnings. Well, by every mean, we'll do so. So, here today, we'll see Molina Perez take on Poe for the TWF Allegheny Share winnings. Uh, Astronomer says. And Eclipter says, it will be cool to see how Poe does. And how Molina Perez does in this match or in this fight. So let's get this fight going on now. <sighs> well, we heard from the overseer of leadership of the Toy Wrestling Gathering, Astronoma, and now we got the match under. We got this match going now, and we got the fight keeper in the ring, or the match keeper, I guess, the fight keeper. This match is for the TWF Allegheny Share winnings. First, he is Poe, and she is the TWF Allegheny Share fighter, Melina Perez. First off, we don't know what the English word Allegheny, what the English word for Allegheny is, because that's more of a, I guess, Cyan, Shovak, I don't know, some North Vinlandish borrowed word from one of the sundriest firstborn folks of North Vinland. Could be a Cherokeeish borrowed word, a Cyanish borrowed word, a Tokiish borrowed word, I don't know. But it doesn't belong in English. And right now Poe's not doing very well, Mike today says. Molina Perez, who won the TWF Allegheny share winnings after it was held up. And Melina Perez has done very well for herself. I mean, she was a former TWF world heavyweight, a former world heavyweight fighter, Mike today says. Yeah, well, yes, that is true, Jim Ross said. Melina Perez did win the TWF, did win the world heavyweight winnings way back in 2007, YL. No one can forget her war against Lord Zed back then, Jim Ross says. And Melina Perez coming in right now. How did she miss that? And now Poe just body slammed Melina Perez, Mike today says. Jim Ross said Poe's doing it again. Booker T says, how can Poe even think that he's going to... Uh, that he's going to beat Melina Perez. Oh! 
when all of that sports fighting he knew, that fighting craft he learned, and it didn't help him very well when he wanted to win the TWF 24-7 winning from Zia Lee. So what made him think he could do it against Molina Perez? And now Poe right now down. And Poe just took down Molina Perez again. You know. And yes, Booker T says Poe might be a good skilled fighter, whatever fighting craft he knows, but it didn't help him all the times in the ring, so why is it going to help him now? Poe come back, oh, ran right in the ring steeple. See, Booker T says, he ran right in the ring steeple, so I told you his fighting craft, his sports craft, his sports fighting craft, whatever you want to call it, didn't help him at all. Molina Perez, coming back, Jim Ross says. Yes, she did a purple, she did a spin, a moon saw, or whatever you want to call it, from the top steeple, Jim uh, Mike today says. Well, Jim Ross said, you don't have to worry, you don't have to worry about Scott Steiner getting pissed off at you, Jim Ross says, and saying, don't call it that, call it the Steiner line. Steiner line, whatever, Jim Ross says. Yeah, I don't have to worry about that anymore, Mike today says, thank God. Oh yeah, Booker T says, you know, thank God, Booker T said, you don't. But thank God Melina Perez is beating Poe, so that's good enough. One, two, three. Ding, ding, ding. Here is your winner, and still the TWF Allegheny Share Fighter, Poe. I mean, Melina Perez. Well, Melina Perez right now is the TW, still the TWF Allegheny Share Fighter. She beat Poe, you know, here today on, here today on NXT. And I know a lot of folk. I know a lot of folks out there, you know. And there was a lot of times where we fought that Molina Perez had Poe beat, or Poe fought she had Molina Perez beat, and it did not happen. Mike today says, "No, it did not." Jim Ross says, "Poe did everything he could do to win the TWF Allegheny Share winnings. Molina Perez did everything she could do." To keep it, and that's the match we got to see here today on NXT. Jim Ross says, "I'll tell you one thing right now." Booker T says, "See now, I got now. You know why Poe would not be a good TWF Allegheny Share fighter since he didn't even win the strap. You know that's why, and it has nothing to do with him being a a dream work, a dream work likenesses, a dream work self." Uh, Booker T says, so it has nothing to do with him being a DreamWork film self. It had with you thinking he's not good enough to be a wrestler or to be a fighter, Mike today says. Is that what it's all about, Jim Ross says? You're hating on Poe, scathing Poe, guilting Poe, shaming Poe for no ground sake or why, Jim Ross said. Well, and he would take it away by Joey Styles. Thank you, Mike Today and Jim Ross. I'm going to be talking of Molina Perez here today on NXT. All right, Molina Perez. We just seen you have your match with Poe here today on NXT. Yeah, I had an open deer, Joey Styles, and I truly didn't think that Poe was going to answer that open deer. But hey, I want to be a fighting TWF Allegheny Share fighter. And I know that's overkill, and I know a lot of folks say that when they either win the heavyweight, or the world heavyweight, or the tag team, or the 24-7, a hard middle, or Pennsylvania Reich, Allegheny Share, light heavyweight, whatever. Women's heavyweight, women's world heavyweight, women's tag team, you know, they say that. But I, you know, I truly mean it. So, at the end of the day, 
I'm going to have another open dare soon. And I don't know who's going to take me up on it. So you're going to have another open dare soon for the TWF Allegheny Share or winnings. That's right. That's what I'm going to do. I'm not going to make any oaths and say that's going to bring down uh, income. Allegheny Share can bring down share income toll. I'm not going to say that that uh, that I'm ever going to stand or run for head leadership follower of Allegheny Share since I don't live in Allegheny Share, so I couldn't stand for it. But I am going to be a fighting TWF Allegheny Share fighter all the same. You know, just got to have the right time, the right opening, and the right luck. Well, you and you had a great match with Poe, and will you be open-minded if Poe wants to have another match with you? Well, if Poe wants to have another match with me, then yes, I am open-minded to fighting Poe again. You know, Poe is one, he's a good wrestler, good fighter, a good overstar. You know, he has a fighting craft. You know, he learned some fighting craft. A long time ago and he's done very well for himself if he wants to fight me again and I'll do it well that's my talk my talk with Melina Perez back to you Mike today and Jim Ross well thank you Joey Styles for talking with Melina Perez here today on NXT and that's all the time we have here for NXT I might today with Jim Ross and Booker T. We hope you like NXT, and we'll see you tomorrow for Dynamite or Mike.